Hey guys, welcome back to Top 10 Nerd. I'm your host Kelly Pally, and we're back at it again with alternate versions of Robin. We kept the list primarily focused on Dick Grayson this time around, but, but not entirely limited to. So without any more hesitation, let's just jump right in. And at number 10 is Deathwing. Deathwing appears in the main DC continuity, first appearing in 1991 in New Titans Annual Number 7. He was recruited by Time Trapper to be a sleeper agent, and was sent to the future with implanted memories of Dick Grayson's, where he trained a bunch of teams of superpower teens. And then when he came back in time, things got kinda messed up. Well, really messed up, actually. He raped his former lover, Mirage, and ended up impregnating her. And at number 9 is Batman Reign of Terror, Rochelle Wayne. The role of Robin in this one goes to Bruce Wayne's sister, Rochelle Wayne. When she discovered what her brother had been up to, she she dons a Robin costume. They are aptly standing for her name. So the plot to this one consists of Captain Bruce Wayne becoming a masked rogue who fights crime at night, and then partakes in the French Revolution during the daytime, all while hunting for the world's most terrifying weapon, the Blade of Death. And at number 8 is Injustice. In the Injustice universe, Damian Wayne is Robin, and is a supporter of Superman's regime. He's responsible for Dick Grayson's death, but it was an accident during a prison riot. And spoiler alert friends, in the prequel comic to Injustice 2, he's been imprisoned. But that's all we'll get into for now since, well, it's pretty darn new. But what I will tell you is that he definitely doesn't stay in prison though. In at number 7 is Just Imagine's Robin. Just Imagine, aka Earth 6, is Stan Lee's version of DC favorites. This Robin is an orphan who is manipulated into becoming a homicidal thief for that series' villain, Reverend Dark. Two Ks. He's given the task of killing Batman, who then shows Robin the truth about Reverend Dark, causing him to switch sides and fight for good. But nope, psych, he's still actually working for the Reverend the entire time. And at number 6 is Sparrow. Getting into the amalgam comics here, Sparrow is an amalgamation between Carrie Kelly's Robin in Marvel's Jubilee. And she basically looks like Jubilee physically with that Robin costume. Good sense of fashion though. And power wise, well, she's inherited energy projection from her Marvel roots. In at number 5 is Moonwing. While this one's cheating a bit, it's an alternate version of Dick Grayson, so we want to include it on the list. Moonwing is another gem from the Amalgam comics, combining Nightwing and Marvel's Moon Knight. The character was featured in Bruce Wayne, Agent of S.H.I.E.L.D., where, you guessed it, Bruce was an amalgamation of Bruce Wayne and Nick Fury. In at number 4 is Samurai Robin. From the Robin 1996, Elseworlds Annual. We're in 16th century Japan, introduced to a young warrior who's only referred to by his nickname Tengu, which means bird spirits, a name given to him by Cat Ninja, aka Catwoman. He was raised by Bat Samurai, who was killed in battle, and when it's revealed that he's the rightful heir to the Imperial Throne, the villain in this universe, the Usurper, tries to kill him for this reason, leading Tengu to kill the Usurper out of self-defense, but then inevitably committing suicide for the dishonor. And at number 3 is Vampire Robin of Earth 43. In Batman and Dracula Red Rain, we're introduced to a Robin who has a taste for the red stuff. So in this universe, the flying Graysons are killed by Vamp Batman, causing Dick Grayson to grow up as an obsessive vampire hunter, until he's turned into a vampire himself and aligns himself with Batman. He also is a member of the Blood League, aptly named, which is just the vampire version of the Justice League. And at number 2 is Redbird, from the blue, the grey, and the bat. Taking place during the American Civil War, this one is commonly known as the western version of Batman. So of course, he is joined by a Native American named Redbird. Redbird's family were killed by white men, and he's out for revenge, and ends up assisting Batman in the good old wild wild west. And finally in at number 1 is Spirit Rob, from JLA The Nail and JLA Another Nail. We've talked a little bit about JLA The Nail in our other alternate versions videos, so let's take a look at how Robin is portrayed in this universe. The story occurs when Jonathan and Martha Kent's truck gets a flat tire after striking a nail, preventing them from finding kal -El's spaceship. Moving several years forward, Robin and Batgirl are then tortured and murdered by the Joker, which drives Batman temporarily insane, having been forced to watch it all happen. He kills the Joker. And then, in the sequel JLA Another Nail, Dick returns as a spirit when the Joker returns from hell, helping Batman defeat the Joker for good. There we have it friends, did your favorite version of Robin make this list? Which versions did we include? Let us know in those comments below, and as always, if you dug the video, make sure you hit those like and subscribe buttons. I've been Kelly Pally for Top 10 Nerd, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.